Hey guys, did you ever download a nice PNG only to find out that this transparent backdrop is a fake and you cannot really use it? So today we're going to fix that using Adobe Express. If you don't know what is it, Adobe Express is simply like Canva from Adobe. So it's web-based editor, it's free to use. So let's check it out. Here I am in Adobe Express. I'm going to use this quick action section below to remove backdrop. So I just hit background remover and now I drag and drop my fake PNG. Let's give it a moment to analyze the image. And here's our result. And that's actually the transparent backdrop right now. So I think it's really good. I can just hit download and I got my real PNG download to my folder already but I can continue editing in the Adobe Express as well. Let's drag the original file here so we can compare that and evaluate the result. So I drag and drop this file on the right and the Adobe Express removed the backdrop. And I'm really, really surprised here that they were able to remove this very dark fake shadow below the car. That's really big surprise for me. And I must say, I impress here. So we got a really nice result for fixing this fake png so that's something we can do using adobe express well done let's check one more image this time not a fake png but a quite complex image so i'll just drag and drop this little doggy here as you can see the edge is really irregular and the background is gradient so let's check this out and I think that's quite a decent result. We can of course click download to download the PNG with transparent backdrop. And we can also edit inside the Adobe Express. I will drag the original one so we can compare the result for removing backdrop here. Let's zoom in a little bit. As I mentioned, the edge is really rough. Here we got this for around we still can see a little bit of blue glow from the old backdrop but i think it's really decent job for this auto magic removal for backdrop so that's how you can fix your fake pngs just drag and drop them into adobe express and download them again without backdrop this time all right thank you for watching and i hope i will see you in my next tutorial bye